with the release of Skywatch Aerial Island. Players can assemble and collect digital cards as they explore the world of Terra. Exploring new areas, dungeons, completing quests, and killing monsters can all reward you with card fragments. Collect 20 fragments of a card, then add it to your collection. Each card boosts one or more of your stats when equipped, and can unlock further special effects when combined with other cards in your collection. And if you collect additional fragments for a card already in your collection, they can be traded with your friends or sold through the trade broker for gold. Once you've got a few cards in your collection, it's time to equip them and go adventuring. The first two cards you collect, Seer and the Grazing Nurik, both give a boost to your physical resistance. The Grazing Nurik also grants additional physical resistance when fighting monsters with the Beast Tag. For even more fun, the combination of both cards in your collection unlocks the Long for Peace effect, which adds more resistance, boosts your damage, and heals you a bit after defeating an opponent. Your card collection belongs to you, not your character. As soon as you assemble them, your cards are available to all your characters on the same server. Completing a level 11 intro quest on any of your characters unlocks the card collection system for the rest. So, you don't have to do that quest again, and you don't have to wait forever to unlock more powerful cards. Just keep playing Terra the way you always have, and your collection will come together in no time. Do you have additional questions or comments about Terra's new card collection system? Reach out to us on our social media channels and become part of the conversation.